started uh, Flexible Display Center, our main mission was to um, uh, advance the manufacturing process in flexible displays. We're working on what we view as the next generation of display technologies. Displays today uh, are those big 62-inch screens that everybody's hurrying up to buy and stick in their living rooms, uh, or the little touch screens that you have on your iPhone. Uh, and so what we spent all our time doing is figuring out ways to put electronics that today is put onto silicon or onto glass onto something flexible. Once we figured that out, we need to figure out how to do it on really big sheets of plastic because that's the way things are manufactured in the real world. We are, of course, mostly funded uh, by the U.S. Army, uh, and uh, the, the Army wants these for exactly this kind of thing. Uh, a display that can be worn on the wrist of a soldier. It's out of the way. If it gets banged, it doesn't, it doesn't get hurt. But if there's some absolutely critical piece of information that that soldier needs to do to, to save his life or to, to help him do his job better, it's available. When I started in 2004, I was a student. I, I got my master's in Arizona State University, and then I moved on to uh, get a PhD here um, under uh, Dr. Ali. And uh, once I completed in 2007, I uh, joined uh, Flexible Display Center uh, as a design engineer. As a student, when you start off in Arizona State University, uh, this um, facility provides you immense infrastructure to uh, uh, hone your skills, and which can be utilized in the industry uh, uh, after your education. The Flexible Display Center, as it was created with the Army, resulted in a number of companies, global companies, locating themselves in the flexible display center environment and this became a magnet to attract a number of those companies to the consortium as well as jobs to the area. From ASU's perspective what we've done is we've created a new way to educate uh, the workforce, the scientific and technical workforce that's going to be needed to make these kinds of high-tech uh, industries go uh, in our shores in the future. Uh, the source of what we all hope will be nice uh, high-paying high-tech jobs here in, the, here in the Phoenix area in, in the years to come.